The Janie and Doff Briscoe Division of Cardiology was made possible through the generous support of the Briscoes, one of our former Texas governors and his first lady. Uh, their long-term dedication to UT San Antonio is evident uh, throughout the institution as you'll see their name appear. Uh, they were particularly friends of the Division of Cardiology. The division has a storied history. The first balloon expandable intracoronary stent was developed at UT San Antonio by Palmas and Schatz. That technology is still employed today and almost every coronary stent utilized in clinical care throughout the world. Here in cardiology, we obviously take care of one of the largest groups of medical patients seen uh, in clinical practice, patients with cardiovascular diseases. Uh, we sit in an epicenter of cardiovascular disease in South Texas with a very high incidence of diabetes, coronary artery disease, peripheral arterial disease, and heart failure. That combination makes us an excellent training ground for physicians interested in developing a practice in cardiovascular medicine. Our division encompasses over 20 faculty with wide ranging interests, including imaging, uh, interventional and invasive cardiology, advanced heart failure, and clinical cardiology. We also have uh, research faculty engaged in a variety of research uh, endeavors, including basic science uh, of the mitochondrion in cardiovascular disease, as well as hemodynamics and coronary artery disease. Our practice not only includes outpatient clinical settings in our Mark Clinic, but also at the Brady Green University Hospital System Clinic on the south side. Uh, the Audie Murphy VA Medical Center, uh, and of course our premier and main teaching institution, University Hospital, here as part of the University Health System. In that institution, uh, we provide full spectrum tertiary care uh, for cardiovascular disease on an inpatient basis as well as an outpatient basis. We have uh, cardiac catheterization laboratories, non-invasive imaging spaces, and an inpatient service that includes both a cardiac care unit and uh, an inpatient cardiology telemetry unit. Our faculty rotate uh, throughout all of these uh, areas, uh, providing invasive and non-invasive care to both inpatients and outpatients. Our fellows, uh, through their rotations on these services, are exposed to all aspects of cardiovascular disease, uh, as well as our methods of diagnosing and treating that disease. In addition to UHS, as I mentioned, we have the Audie Murphy VA, uh, which is part of the South Texas VA Medical Center. Uh, in that practice, uh, our fellows are exposed to both inpatient and outpatient clinical work, including uh, cardiac care units, interventional cath labs, non-invasive imaging, and the cardiology clinics. Research opportunities exist for trainees uh, interested in both clinical research work, whether it might be clinical trials uh, or uh, focused investigational studies, uh, as well as uh, translational science for those who are so interested. One of our newest developments in cardiology is the, the opening uh, of our new Heart and Vascular Institute space located on the ground floor of the Sky Tower of University Hospital. This is almost 50,000 square feet of dedicated space for clinical work and cardiovascular diseases. It includes five cardiac catheterization laboratories, multiple uh, echocardiography bays, uh, stress testing bays, a uh, comprehensive recovery unit uh, for both pre- and post-procedure care, uh, as well as facilities for inpatient and outpatient diagnostic testing. This 
in addition to our Sky Tower ninth floor where our ICU and inpatient units are, really provide the newest, uh, most up-to-date clinical space in San Antonio for the delivery of cardiovascular care. Here our motto is, we make lives better. And our approach to making lives better involves three components. First of all, clinical care. Uh, we take care of a group of patients who are sorely affected by the variety of complications associated with cardiovascular disease, uh, complicated by diabetes and renal dysfunction. Additionally, uh, we are in actively engaged in research areas, not only in diabetes, but also in cardiorenal syndrome and coronary artery disease and primary prevention and in heart failure. Finally, uh, we are committed to training the next generation of cardiovascular disease specialists uh, who not only will have academic careers, but also will have clinical careers throughout the United States. We feel it's important to impart upon you, uh, our trainees and potential trainees, not only a sound knowledge of cardiovascular disease, but also a great understanding of how that disease affects our communities and how you can impact on the disease in those communities.